Okay, so I've completed my lid and what I've done is I've finished papering the whole top and then I coated it with diamond glaze for a protective film. You can actually wipe this off with a damp cloth if it gets dirty. I added a key also using diamond glaze and this stuff is just miraculous. It dries super hard and I use it for everything. And I added a button using the same stuff and I am going to set that aside and the last touch I did add some paper to this can just a piece on each side and streaked it with the lighter pink and for the last and final touch I'm going to simply add some tacky glue just a thin strip all the way around I'd say totally from start to finish this took me probably about an hour so that's not pretty bad and you can make you know uh, two or three of these at the same time using the same techniques and different elements which I will show you in a minute because that's exactly what I did so I'm just going to glue this ribbon around the outside like that then I'm going to take another ribbon that's just a little richer in color for fun and I'm going to tie it around the top ribbon and I'm just going to tie it and that will complete this wonderful can that can now be used like add rhinestones to the ribbon or tags you can add a tag to it and there you have the lid the key will lift the lid off and for an extra special touch you can just pop open a box of sweethearts and drop them right in and or you know I actually put them in a plastic container and then I pour them in there and just you know just oh my goodness what a sweet gift that is so there you have it this is another can I did and this can I painted with white gesso and then I sprayed on some Tim Holtz color wash in butterscotch to give it a uh, antique edge and this is actually simply a cardboard box just a small cardboard box half a sheet of paper not even copper tape a little extra touch on the lid there a little fuzzy ribbon around it and there you have it these quick gift ideas can be made for any occasion in a hurry everyone has a tin can somewhere in their house and imagine the surprise on someone's face when you come up with something like this that you made yourself that is this special I hope you had as much fun as I did making this special can and I look forward to seeing you again and you have a great journey and colorful dreams bye